It is the exact opposite in South Florida, where rising seas are threatening Miami Beach. Vicente Arenas is there. Not far from tourist hotspots, Miami Beach has started construction on underground pumping stations to protect the city from flooding caused by rising sea levels and extreme storms. It's hard to beat Mother Nature. Yes, it is. Scott Robin is helping manage the $400 million drainage project. After these pumps are installed, we won't see one drop of seawater on our streets. That's our goal. Today's report says sea levels could rise along 5,700 square miles of the southeast coast. The most vulnerable cities include New Orleans, Tampa, St. Petersburg, and Virginia Beach. Scientific models predict most of Miami Beach could be underwater by the end of the century. And this city says that it won't stop fighting from going underwater. Miami Beach is hoping to have 60 new pumping stations built within the next five years. And Scott, they're hoping to have stronger codes here that would require buildings and homes to be built higher off the ground. Vicente, thank you. There's going to be much more on the climate change story, including Megan Glaros is speaking with the president about what the U.S. can do to slow climate change. All of that tomorrow on CBS This Morning.